Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, you all may call me Pharaoh, and welcome to what should be a very, very, very quick LP, maybe, of some indie game called Access Denied. It, you know, I don't know, I picked this up for like a dollar because it's a puzzle game where it's kind of like, uh, I guess it's kind of like The Room, and which is like another puzzle game where you had to like, you know, solve a bunch of locks and puzzles to open things up. And this is kind of the same thing, just but very indie. And I heard it's not like the absolute greatest, but like, uh, you know, just based on reviews, you know, no jabs on the, on the developers, but uh, I, I want to give it a run for myself. Um, and I'm thinking it might be short because there's apparently 36 different cases. And um, these ones right here, I'm up to 13. I did that off screen because I was playing it. I'm like, you know what, wait, maybe this would be like a nice video to do for the channel. So, uh, it went by kind of quick. Some stuff kind of did stump me a little bit, but, uh, we'll see what will happen. So let's go ahead and just begin with the first case. Uh, yes, I'm gonna load it. And I'll go ahead and explain some of the controls as well. So, well, actually, they explain right here. Find a way to circumvent the protection and gain access to the storage device. Left, uh, left mouse button to interact and right mouse button to rotate. So, kind of like, you know, uh, keep talking, nobody explodes. Um, I'm using the right, the right mouse button to like uh, move the camera angle and rotate it and I can click on things using the left one I can also zoom in using the scroll wheel as well so if you want I mean you can take a look into all of these uh, boxes but you know sometimes they're not really hard it seems like all you gotta do here is just push all the sw switches on and that's it <laughs> one down 35 more to go it's kind of interesting right here to have my local time as I'm recording this. So here we got a bunch of things, uh, kind of like dials, and they have one that sticks out. So it looks like all we have to do is just line it up. Now I'm not sure if these are kind of randomized, because I could have sworn those are in different positions before, but then again, could be wrong. So very simple. This one, you can probably take a look, it's like weird symbol, you move the slider, different numbers, it's like, oh, okay. You look around, and it's like, oh, there's a guide of sorts. So all you gotta do is kind of determine what's on each one and uh, make out the right numbers. So that is an eight. That one, so I might be going back and forth on trying to figure out, like, Oh, wait a minute, is this the right one? Is that the right one? Because a lot of these are semi kind of similar. But, uh, what are you going to do? Okay. I th think that's a five? I think. And there you go. So that's why I say this, this game might be pretty short. Um, but we'll see. And there's, like, no music, unfortunately. I may have I made put in music. I mean, I, I love rain. Don't don't get me wrong. I love the sound of rain. It makes me fall asleep like a baby. But yeah, you might want to have some type of soothing music to play. So here it's like, oh, what do I do? And can't do anything. Can't go back. So you can reset. I'll show you the pattern. As you can see, any anytime you move, you can't go back. And it looks like we want all those pieces. There you go. Now, I could just, I I thought there was like a game on Windows ninety five that. Something was very similar to that. I could be wrong. Uh, putting in numbers. Don't see anything else here. But the only hint that we get, we have the number fifty-five up there. We have three. Uh, wait, excuse me. What? That was not. That's not three slots. That's eight slots. So I guess what you could do is um. Just add up whatever combination you can to get 55. That's one of that's one way to do it. <laughs> Let's see here. This one. I, I will eventually get a, catch up to number 13. What, what, I stopped that. So here doesn't look like there's anything behind us. And I see these and. We can maneuver these around, so I would think we put yellow on yellow and blue on blue. And that's exactly it. 
There's probably a reason why this game was a dollar when I got it. I got it with a pack of like four other games. Uh, I was like, you know what, let me just pick some stuff I think are going to be interesting to, to play. Some just like, you know, kill time, some just to have fun with. I was thinking of streaming this, but I'm like, you know, eh. Make it, make it a nice little video, I guess. Uh, let's see here. And there we go. <laughs> Just got uh, click off all the lights. It, it, it seems like a lot of these puzzles, we maybe you you all watching or maybe even myself have come across these puzzles before in other games and that's why maybe might might be a little bit easier to solve. Like for example, like this, it's like can't go back, but we can reach that, but didn't do anything. Here. This one is, yeah, I remember I, I was like stuck here for a teeny because I'm like, nothing's happening. But we just need a, yeah. We have an image. Sorry for the static, but maybe I can try going, going through this as quick as I can. Right, and go all the way up. Is there two more to the right? How many down though? And that's it. Goodbye, static. Barely knew ye. Okay, number nine. I remember this one confused me for a little bit because. You see that there's graphs, and we can change it. And I thought that all we had to do was... Because this is the only side that doesn't have buttons. So it's like, oh, maybe we just got to match them all up to that. That is not the case. And I'm like, well, what else are we supposed to do? Well, if you pay kind of close attention... Um, let's see if I can find the right one. There we go. You'll see that... They all correlate, and they run with each other. Like, you know, blue is going toward the middle, and then red's going toward the top. That's how you're supposed to solve it. Um, I will admit, yeah, I, when I was first playing, when I tested this game out uh, for a little bit, I was confused. I'm like, I thought all, all I had to do was uh, just make them all the same. Nope. Okay, number 10. Now this one... Okay, so we have those symbols again. And we have a couple of them here. Some are kind of scratched out. So based on our previous knowledge, we knew we know that it was like, you know, 0 to 8 or whatever. And let me see how far this goes. There's zero, one, two, oops. zero, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I think we just got kind of correlate it. So that one, uh, that's what we got. So we assume that's a zero, so we keep it down there. Or actually, yeah, that, that's right. So that one, I think, is a two. All right. I may be going back and forth on this quite a bit. That one... Uh, oh, we actually don't know. We have to kind of guess what this one's going to be. It's either going to be four or five. So we'll hold off on that one. This one is going to be three. Zero, one, two, three. That one's going to be a one. So we know that these... Are, these are going to be either four or five, so let's check this, and there you go. Just a process of elim 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 elimination on that one. Okay, what do we got here? Um, a couple buttons that we can flip on or off. It kind of reminds me of binary, you know, zero, one. Here's the only thing that's different here is uh, it says KR... 00101101P. Thinking simple enough, we just turn on the ones that that have one. That's it. 
Okay. Number 11. What do we have this time around? Okay, we have different colored numbers. And three panels. We can slide things up. Okay. I remember I remember doing this a little bit. We have to find something that correlates to the different colors. So we saw three. So let's let's focus on blue for right now. I know we're getting the other colors too, but we'll just hold off. That's a times, I believe. So three times what? Help me out a little bit, game. Three times five? That is 15. All right. I think I saw red here, too. Sure, you can be taking notes, do whatever, but F it. So five plus, we need another red. Come on. Okay. Five plus seven. It's 12. And honestly, if you want, you can probably just go... Oh, well... Didn't want to solve it like that, but I was like, if you wanted, not since we know what the first two numbers were, we can keep going one by one to get the other number, but I think it was like 8 minus 6. So, there you go. Number 12, I think we are almost to the part where I stop playing. Uh, what is going on here? Oh, you know what? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I... Um... I guessed this one. I'm a little unsure of what they're asking me. I mean, once again, we can assume that's, you know, 0 through 8, or 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... What is that, 9? Wait. Yeah, it's, apparently it's up to 9, right? So I'm like, I don't know what you want from me game and I honestly didn't see anything uh, on this device that kind of gave me like an idea of what I need to press I'm sure you guys are gonna correct me in the in the comments below go ahead and do so uh, I'm just not sure how it correlates but I, re I do know like it's or maybe okay hold on See, I, I was kind of close. I, yeah, once again, I don't know how or how you're supposed to figure, determine that's the order, but I was like, I'm thinking the numbers, and so that's zero and five, and I was like, does that matter? I, I don't know. So here's the one that I stopped at. We I haven't gotten faster, and uh, we got one that says middle spiel, middle spiel. Um, okay, okay. So I do not know how to solve this just yet. Oh, okay. Wait, did I solve this? I don't know. Okay. So, wait. Oh, I'm in here. 9, 5, 9, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5, 7. Oh, okay, game. I, I think I see what you're going at here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, I believe. And this was... Five blue, so one, two, three, four, five. And finally, where the hell is it at? Seven yellow. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. See? Sometimes it's simple enough. <laughs> okay. Well, this is number 15 now. Okay, so this is brand new territory for me, ladies and gentlemen. Now I can actually try using my brain a little bit. <laughs> now watch me just get really stumped. Um, okay, I don't see anything else. Um, 
I don't see anything else I can look at with the bomb here, so we're gonna click some buttons. Nothing on that side. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, I see. I th think this is how we're supposed to do it. Or, wait, excuse me. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. Do I need that? Huh. Okay. Well, as you can already tell, I'm a little stumped. Hmm. Oh. No, I'm still... I think I, I don't want this to connect, but I'm not sure how else I can go about it. We can... Let's, let's figure this out really quick. Maybe I, maybe I clicked on something I, I shouldn't have, and I don't know. Uh, yep, yeah, then again, now we're stuck. Because I can't... Because even though I, I'm not trying to connect the two, and I, I don't, I don't think that's the case. Oh, you know why? Okay, I, I forgot. I didn't see the arrows. Ah, fudge! There you go. There you go. See? <laughs> you gotta pay attention to those arrows. It's kind of like a, uh, a flow to it, right? Number sixteen. I don't know what's going on there. Or there. Can't click anything there. Oh, oh. Oops. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can see anything on top. Oh, uh, what? In God's name. The only thing I can think of is like I click the numbers, the number of blue or n number of colors that uh, equal up. Or that are actually lit, lit up. Actually, guys, could you give me one second, because it's getting a little loud in my house, and I need to, you know, have to be quiet. I'll be right back. Alrighty, back in action. Let's go ahead and uh, solve this puzzle. Now, like I said, I believe I just pushed the number of buttons with how many are lit up, so... I think so, anyway, but sometimes it's going to be kind of hard to tell, like, what's, what, what's lit up and what's not. That's six. That's nine. That... Okay. That sure as hell don't look right. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Right? It looks like there's nine red lights on, but unfortunately, I don't see... Oops. I don't see anything... Besides these six. Yeah, this is definitely not right. There's a lot of blue here. And blue's all lit up. I'm trying to think here, like... Alright, see? I'm, I'm stumped. <laughs> we are stumped, unfortunately. And maybe you guys are yelling at me like... Pharaoh's not that hard, and it's like, I, I'm sorry? I don't see anything on top either, so... Can't, can't go to the bottom. Alright. Let's, let's think here. Unless... Hmm. Unless it correlates with the rows. Maybe. So there's one, two... There's only two on that row. One, two, three. Three there. And in terms of yellow, 
one. Okay, that's not it either. Um, damn. How the hell am I supposed to solve this? This is gonna be bad. Oh wait, did I click? On? Oh. Like I see, like, why? Well, well, I thought these arrows, and I don't think they pertain to anything that I need. Huh. Okay, I'm. I'm unsure what to do here. This blows. <laughs> I guess I'll be back when I figure this one out. Oh my god, I think I understand now. Okay, wow. I was counting the numbers on each, or counting the colors on each side, and I came up like there's three red, three red, three red. Four blue, four blue, four blue, two yellow, two yellow, two yellow. That's what I think it, it has to be, right? There we go. Okay, game. And see, sometimes... You, this, is, this might be bad for me, because you, you, you guys know me. I tend to overthink stuff like this. And that's not good. Uh, what? Oh, uh, okay. We are going to have to keep messing around until we... Get this as high as it can go, I guess. Okay. So that's one side, and then we do the... Wait. The hell? Okay, so it has to be, like, some type of combination. Alright, wait, hold on. There. Wait, did it, did it just shift on me? Oh my god, I didn't, I didn't realize that, um... I didn't realize that how, there was two different... Uh, dials there. Okay. <laughs> nope. Okay, nope. Alright, so this is the last one. So it was just basically... Um... Basically just a combination of all the other... Uh, puzzles we've done so far. However, what's what's going on here? Why is this one not correct? It's going down. It's lighting all that up in the right order, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, let's... Let me rethink this one really quick. Why are you not being happy with me? Oh, because some of them I don't need to uh, connect. Okay. Alright. That one's a little bit more involved. Alright. Ooh, you know what? How, how many uh, boxes are there? 36 and... Uh, you know what? F it. In 25 minutes? You know what? Yeah. Let's let's just make this one episode for right now. Uh, well, well, I mean, what I mean, what I meant to say is, like, we'll stop the episode here, and in the next one, uh, maybe you finish the game. <laughs> A nice little two, two-parter two LP, huh? You know, screw all these, like, hundred-part LPs I've been, you know, I've been going on, like, 50-something, 40-something parts. Nah, let's get, like, the single-digit ones going, rolling out now. Let's get more variety going. So uh, next time, ladies and gentlemen, we'll go through hopefully the other 18 
puzzle boxes and finish the game, I guess. So as usual, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time for Let's Play Access Denied. Have a great day, everybody.